By default, the uh, view mode is value added, non value added. However, these options here lean analysis, Kaizen, SMED, and 5S, and user defined, these basically all work the same. They're exactly the same. You would use these different categories depending on the type of project you're doing and how you want to uh, to, to define them. You can see here as I make selections, these are our default lean categories, our default uh, Kaizen categories, our default uh, SMED can change over categories, uh, 5S cleaning up. So these you can actually color code, you can add your own to it as well. The way you do it is always, always the same. So let's say we're actually working with a lean uh, project here. And we want to edit the groups. We click on edit groups and it brings it up. We can start defining our own colors here. So I might leave it gray here. I can select this and I start to color code these. So I come down here and the inspection is going to be maybe green. Uh, the movement is going to perhaps be uh, blue, let's say. Uh, the storage is going to be is going to be maybe the red, and maybe the uh, the delays themselves are going to be maybe the purple. Okay, if you want to add a new one, you can say new here, right? And you might say wait work. That's the guy's delayed here. You can try and save that and then assign it a code. So let's say we call it an orange one here. So now we've color coded all our individual activities here, and we say we're done. So we have everything available here. And then how we apply them is as follows. Now to assign the groupings to specific items really could not be simpler. You simply highlight the option you want to work with. Let's say it's an operation and you click on it. Click once. So you can see I can just click through here, color coding them. Maybe we move on to the inspection. All right, so we're going to have the inspection might be um, here under here. Inspection. Insert cover with ESD, they can do that there, inspect on the side, that's our inspection. And then we get movements, so we're going to say buff parts. So you see here we can start color coding the whole process here. Uh, storage, we might have um, clean press area, right? Delays, um, don't really see any delays right now, so we'll just ignore that right now. And maybe some weight works, so maybe you do some weight over here. So you can see you can generate a completely customized uh, color coded process based upon the groupings depending on what you picked. Here's the lean analysis, Kaizen, SMED, continuous, uh, continuous improvement for the Kaizen, changeovers for the SMED, 5S, cleaning up the work area, usually defined anything else you wish here. And these are all stored individually with the study, so it gives you a lot of capabilities to analyze your data in many different ways.